A youth hockey team from Ukraine arriving in the Chicago area to raise money to rebuild their ice rink destroyed by Russian bombs. WGN Sean Lewis is live in Romeoville where the team is practicing for a tournament. Hi, Sean. Hi there to you, Dana and Pat. Practice actually wrapped up just a few minutes ago. The boys and everyone else have gone, and uh, most of them are 12, 13 years old. Uh, one is seven. Uh, another one is celebrating his 18th birthday today, and what a way to celebrate because the whole team and everyone on this trip are going to be going to the Blackhawks Bruins game tonight at the United Center. Now, everyone arrived here in Chicago yesterday for three day after three days of traveling from Ukraine. This is really the first time a lot of them have been out outside of their country since the Russian invasion a year ago. Their home ice rink, as you mentioned, in Kharkiv was destroyed early on in the war. Many of these players have not been able to practice the way that they normally would. Now, today they were practicing ahead of a three-day tournament. It begins Friday here at the Canlan Sports Arena in Romeoville. They'll be playing against teams from the United States, Canada, other parts of the world. Uh, the main focus here is not just playing, but also to fundraise the entry fee for these tournaments. All of that's going toward rebuilding that ice rink in Kharkiv. The players, three coaches, there are 27 players, by the way, and a few moms. We talked to one of them about what it means to have their boys being away from home and the war for now. To show our kids that the dreams may come true, they can come true if they do their best. And uh, to show them once again that there, that, uh, there is life without war. And uh, we do hope that uh, we will have our, our lives back in our time. <laughs> and they will be able to train, to play, to have tournaments at home and live their hockey life. A hockey mom right there, certainly a lot of money being spent, obviously, on equipment and this trip here for this tournament being sponsored by several different organizations. We'll talk more about that coming up at four and five. They will be here for just over two weeks. They will have the tournament here. Uh, they have the Blackhawks game tonight. They're also traveling to Orlando for another set of tournaments, uh, another fundraising event before they finally go home in early April. Uh, again, the they will be here uh, for the next uh, couple of days. This tournament uh, taking place here in Romeoville. We have information on how you can participate. Come see these teams play against one another at WGNTV.com. For now, we are live in Romeoville. Sean Lewis, WGN News.